Hi friends, welcome back to our channel. This is a descriptive video for how to make a long range proximity sensor. To make this, you will need some parts that consist of an IR LED. You can get this IR LED from any old TV remote or you can buy this from any electronic shop. An IR receiver, 2 pin, a 3 volt LED, a transistor. You can choose any PNP transistor. Here I have taken BC557. A 100 kilo ohm rheostat. Two pieces of 100 ohm resistance. And of course, a 3 to 4 volt battery. Now, to make this, first of all, you will need some basic ideas of these components. Uh, for transistor, to guess out the terminals of the transistor, uh, place the plain side of the transistor towards your face and the right side terminal will be the emitter of the transistor and the left side terminal will be the collector of the transistor and the middle terminal will be the base of the transistor. And in IR receiver or LED or IR LED, there is always a long terminal and a short terminal. So here. Uh, the long terminal will be always the positive terminal of these components and the short terminal will be always the negative terminal of the components. And in rheostat, take the middle terminal as the base of the rheostat and the side are the side terminals of the rheostat. Here is the schematic for the long lens proximity sensor. Here is the eye receiver. Uh, this is the positive terminal of the IR receiver and this is the negative terminal. Here is the uh, IR LED. Here is the 100 ohm resistance, 3 to 5 volt battery. Uh, here is the BC557 transistor whose emitter is connected to the negative terminal of the LED and collector is connected to the negative terminal of the battery. And here is the base of the transistor. Here is the 100 ohm resistor. And here is 100 kilo ohm resistor uh, in which the middle terminal of the rheostat is connected to the positive terminal of the battery and the side terminal of the rheostat is connected in series with the 100 ohm resistance. Now let's prepare the circuit on the breadboard. To prepare the circuit, first of all, take the transistor BC557, place it on the breadboard and connect the collector of the transistor to the negative hole of the breadboard through a wire and take the 3 volt LED connect the negative terminal of the LED to the emitter of the transistor and the positive terminal of the LED to the positive hole of the breadboard now take a 100 ohm resistance Connect it to the base of the transistor and connect the other terminal of the resistance to the side terminal of the rheostat and connect the middle terminal of the rheostat to the positive terminal of the breadboard. Now connect the long terminal of the IR receiver to the collector of the transistor and the short terminal to the base of the transistor. Now place the IR LED on the breadboard and connect the positive terminal of the IR LED to the positive hole of the breadboard using a 100 ohm resistance and connect the negative terminal of the IR LED to the negative hole of the breadboard. Now let's connect the battery. Positive terminal of the battery to the positive hole and the negative terminal of the battery to the negative hole and now we have prepared our proximity sensor you can see that whenever i bring my hand above the eye receiver the led starts glowing or i bring anything closer to the eye receiver the led starts glowing and through this rheostat you can control the range of the proximity sensor uh, to decrease the range decrease the resistance through the rheostat and to the increase the range increase the resistance uh, through the rheostat and while using this proximity sensor 
take care that you are not using it in the presence of sunlight or incandescent light because sunlight or incandescent light has a huge amount of infrared which can affect your proximity sensor. Hope you have enjoyed the video. Make your own proximity sensor and subscribe if you like and if you have any doubt please post it in the comment box.